Hi y'all, it's Neva from Manic Mama Musings, and this is Vlogtober Day 5. I am sorry I wasn't on yesterday. I started coming down with a cold, and I'm still congested and whatnot, but I said I was going to do Vlogtober, so this would just be a short one. Watch me ramble on and it not be a short one, but you know, that's how that goes. So day 5, October 5th, day 5 of Vlogtober. Sorry my little how many days till Halloween is not up, it fell. I'll find a better way to put it up. It is 26 days until Halloween, in case you did not know. Um, so, I'm also doing hashtag spirit, uh, podcaster spirit week. So, I just decided to combine the two today. So, um, yesterday was crazy hair day. And then today is, I think, ugly shirt day. I don't have an ugly shirt. So, I wore one of my favorite shirts, which is um, Proud Mama Bear. Um, yeah. There you go. Um, I'm slaying the day. No, I'm not. I slept all day. So, um, I, my hair, I just kind of, I winged it, had ideas and don't have the energy. So there you go. This is what you get. And I'm not sure what tomorrow is, but let's see how that goes. Um, yesterday's song of the day was, like I have told you before, one of my favorite Halloween songs, just because it gets played the most at Halloween time. A one-eyed, one-horn, flying purple people eater, because I've known it since I was a child, by Jimmy Buffett. Can't help it. It's catchy. I like it. Today's song is Veronica the Killer Doll by my own Captain Amazing. By Lowdown. Yes, that's his rap one, but yes, Lowdown. So, check it out. It'll be in the playlist below. Songs. Uh, song of the Day 2022. You should be able to see all of them if you just want to listen to one song. So, yesterday's movie will be today's movie, since I talked about it yesterday, is Stonehurst Asylum. Okay? This is another good, I think it's an excellent movie, plus I've been in a mental hospital, and so I really, I kind of like that theme, okay, so I really like that. I like um, the American Horror Story that happens in the asylum. Love that one. I love Girl Interrupt. I like movies around asylums. What can I say? Um, but yeah, Girl Interrupted. You get the idea. And if it's creepy and scary, even better. This one is, it's just good. It's kind of like another, um, I'm not going to mention the movie, but let's just say it's got a little twist at the end that you're like, oh. I saw it kind of coming. I kind of figured it out before it happened. I didn't say anything because LJ hates it when I'm like, I know it's going to happen. But, um, yeah. So. And that's the fun of those kind of movies for me. Is to see if what I think is going to happen will happen. So I love those kind of movies. But yes. Um, so there's that. The movie before this one was The Legend of Sleepy Hollow. And no, it's not the one with Johnny Depp. It's the one on Freebie. And um, I liked it. Um, I would love to know what your thoughts were on it. My thoughts were, is I like the twist that Ichabod Crane was not the innocent victim, so much the innocent victim that we, that he is portrayed as being. And that the, and then, I mean, don't get me wrong. I like a good villain, but the villain ends up really being the good guy, man. I mean, it's a little bit of a romance horror or something. I don't know which, but anyway, I liked it. A lot um you know it's it i like almost all sleepy hollow versions and so you know um it, i don't know if it's my it's not one of my favorite i mean I, I i liked it it was a good movie to watch it was a good twist um and uh i, I thought it was done well you know like the whole pub scene and the i just it, I liked it a lot. Um, is it one I'll repeat watch? I mean, I did watch it with LJ, but like, you know, and I'd already watched it before. It's probably not one that's going to be on my, I have to watch every Halloween. Will I watch it every once in a while? If it pops up in my mind, yes. So it's not a repeat over and over like we always watch the Friday the 13th and Nightmare on Elm Street, but yeah. So what did you think, babe? I really liked it, and I especially liked the aesthetics. Like, they kept the whole era 
thing. Like, for example, uh, he was heating up grease in order to comb his hair, and yeah. then flies were getting in it. That was cool. Like, I love when they do stuff yes, like that. Yes, and, and I always love a whole uh, a good underdog, but I like it that the underdog was not as innocent in this movie as they portrayed him. Yeah, character flaws. Yes. Love it. Um, but, yeah, so um, but please, in the comments, let me know if you enjoyed it, what your thoughts were, what not. Um, sorry, like I said, I missed a day. I did not feel good. So, tonight... Um, we've already watched it. It's a very good movie, Storm, Stonehurst Asylum. Um, so tomorrow we will talk, I will talk about it and then I'll announce the movie from tomorrow. I don't know how long I'm going to feel cruddy and Friday I have to report for if I don't feel completely dead, I have to report for, um, jury duty, uh, training, grand jury duty training. Yes. I didn't know there was such a thing. I have to do that Friday early in the morning. If I feel really bad, if I feel worse tomorrow, I will call and let them know that I am sick because I am in, in you know, compromised. And um, the fact that I'm sick already, I just don't think it's a good idea if I go. And if they want to put me in jail, I guess they can. I don't know. Because if I feel bad enough, I'm not going until I feel better. I have the whole congested nose, um, eye gunk, swollen face, sore throat, my ears hurt, my body hurts, and I've slept. Yesterday I slept all day, today I slept all day. I'll go back to sleep after this video. There you go. So, And today was some of my favorite weather because it was overcast all day. And wouldn't you know, I didn't get to enjoy it. So, mm. um... Uh, sorry, day three. I don't have joke of it. I don't have none of that. I'm sorry, guys. But um, I'll try to little by little build up for tomorrow so that that way I have a few of the things I've been doing. And no, I haven't finished any Halloween stuff. So there's that too. And no costume. This is the costume today. Um, didn't brush my hair. Just stuck it in ponytails. Crazy hat. Hair day for Llama Mama Kayla. I'll link her again for hashtag podcaster spirit week. Um, I love y'all and hopefully I'm not worse tomorrow and I will see you tomorrow.